Good morning and welcome to Godly Play. We miss all of you so much. I'm happy to be here with you. We're going to start with a song that I like to sing that helps me get ready for the story. And you can sing the song with me. It goes like this. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. Be still and know that I am God. It's okay. Now. Everybody's ready. Watch me to see where I go to get this story so you'll always know where to find it. In the beginning, the baby was born. God chose Mary to be the mother of God, and the Word was born, a wordless child. When the baby looked up into the face of the mother Mary, he already saw the cross. And when he looked into the face of the father Joseph, the cross was there too. The mother Mary and the father Joseph held the baby close. They kept the baby warm. They gave the baby everything that babies need to grow, and the baby began to grow. The baby grew and grew and grew and became a boy. When he was about 12 years old, he went with his mother Mary and his father Joseph and all lots of people from the village of Nazareth to the great city of Jerusalem to keep one of the high holy days. And when the celebration was over, the people from Nazareth went out the great high gate and they started on the road toward home. But suddenly, Mary and Joseph realized that Jesus was not there. They thought he had been playing with the other children. All the other children from their village as they were walking together. But he wasn't there. And so they hurried back into the great city of Jerusalem to find him. Mary and Joseph looked in the dark and narrow streets. They looked in the marketplace where they had bought their food. They looked in the place where they had spent the night. They looked everywhere. Finally, they looked in the temple, and there he was. He was talking to the rabbis, the priests. And when he spoke, they listened, because he knew so much. When they spoke, he listened, because he wanted to learn more. And then Mary and Joseph asked Jesus the question that all parents ask their children, the question that you can never answer. Why did you do this? And Jesus said something really strange. Didn't you know that I would be in my father's house? Mary and Joseph did not understand. Their house was in Nazareth, where Joseph's carpenter shop was. They did not understand, but they did not forget. Now, I wonder if there is anything in this room that we could bring that would help us tell this story. I wonder if there is anything in the room where you are that you could bring and help to tell this story better. I don't know what you're going to bring. Only you know that. You don't have to bring anything if you don't want to. We can just enjoy what we've made together today.
It was nice to share godly play with you this morning. We'll see you again soon.